fishing on a Saturday in February, water temperature 52 degrees. You can find a list of the baits used at the end of this video. Fishing off the rocks right here. Got a bite on the worm. I'm bringing in my fish right now. I had a six pound test line, so I wanted to take it easy, make sure I didn't snap my line. Just letting the fish tire out a little bit. All I was doing is dragging that worm over the rocks. Real, real slow. Using a worm wacky style. And uh, I have a little z wire tie to make sure it stays on. Zip tie, I should say. We got a tie breaker to break. Let me show it up here, too. Would you let me do my camera stuff out here? Remo? Quit fooling around, man. My partner was using a drop shot with the, I believe it's called the Sexy Shad uh, Robo Worm. Uh, oh, you got one. Tiro lo para atrás, eh? Tiro lo para atrás. You did too, man. <laughs> Still here on the rocks, getting some action. We can go over here or wherever. Thanks. Mmm, está bonito. Está bonito. Drop shot was probably more effective than my dragon of the worm, as you can see. It's always good to have different techniques while you're in the boat, see what works better. You're like, get it myself. Look at that pig. Almost as big as mine, dude. Look at that pig. What this video is on show right now is that at the beginning of this trip, I caught two fish. So what we're doing right here is giving each other a hard time about who's on top. Next clip you're about to see is us on the main lake. And we found a high point within the lake that had some fish. So we were uh, fishing that. It's always important during the winter to find where the fish are. You can't just hit the bank and expect to produce. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you have any comments or questions. Leave them below. Thanks.